Today started with sunshine, the afternoon ended with clouds, and the nighttime hour ending with a few rain showers in parts of the area. You can see near the I-80 corridor, a couple showers have been going by there last couple of hours through parts of Lawrence, Northern Butler, Northern Armstrong County, and up and through Mercer, Venango, and Clarion counties. Showers will stay there for about another hour or so. Otherwise, mostly cloudy skies. 39 is the current temperature with humidity at 70% and a southeast wind at 5 miles an hour. Right now in Cranberry, 41 degrees. And a lot of these numbers have been holding steady or actually gone up a degree or two in the last couple of hours. 39 in Churchill and Bethel Park, 40 in Washington, West Mifflin, right now at 39. Temperatures up to 45 degrees in Latrobe. We're going to hold steady with our temperatures overnight tonight. 38 to 40 degrees is where we'll be first thing tomorrow morning. You can see we'll end up in the afternoon in the low 50s as we get that next push of mild air coming across tomorrow afternoon. So we'll love the temperature on Valentine's Day, 52 for the high, mild with clouds. And later in the day tomorrow, we'll see the opportunity for a few rain showers. As we head toward midnight tonight, those showers near the I-80 corridor, though they begin to move away. That starts the process of bringing the milder air into place, which will lead to a lot of clouds across the area throughout the day tomorrow. Dry morning commute, albeit mostly cloudy. The afternoon commute, probably not so lucky. You can see some moisture moving through the area 4 or 5 o'clock tomorrow afternoon from about Allegheny County on south, especially as you get further south, better chance you'll see a little bit more in the way of rain late afternoon and early evening. And this wave, <coughs> excuse me, of energy goes by. As we get into the day on Thursday, some spotty drizzle, maybe around first thing in the morning, so a damp start to the day. And I think our rainiest period will likely come later in the day on Thursday into Thursday night when everyone will see a period of rain showers with an approaching cold front, which will drive through the area as we head into the day on Friday. Here's satellite and radar. You can see that cluster of a little moisture across northeastern Ohio, northwestern Pennsylvania. Again, that's the leading edge of some of that milder air that's beginning to nose into the area right now. As quickly as it moves in, it moves right back out. Disturbance comes across tomorrow. That stirs up again a period of some light showers from Pittsburgh on south in the afternoon and early evening. Some spotty drizzles start the day Thursday and then widespread rain showers to end the day on Thursday with the approaching cold front attached to it an area of low pressure, which will behind it bring some cooler temperatures, but ahead of it, Numbers will continue to surge as we start off Thursday morning. Temperatures will be near 50 and they're going to end the day right around 60 to 62 degrees in parts of the area. So the forecast tonight, no lower than 38 degrees, may hold closer to 40 for overnight lows. Cool with clouds, spot shower coming to an end. Then tomorrow, high temperature 52, milder day with a lot of clouds in the afternoon. There'll be a few showers, especially south. On Thursday, period of some rain, probably steadier and more widespread, 61. The high temperature, 50 on Friday with morning rain showers. Chilliest day of the next several Saturday, a seasonably chilly day, 38. Back to 45 on Sunday and into the mid and upper 50s again early next week. Back to